They don't think I, 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 I pray and hope she knew she was loved. A tragic loss pulling loved ones together tonight to use her story to empower others to seek help before it's too late. Thank you so much for joining us this evening. I'm Amber Grigley. 24-year-old Shania Shaw was shot and killed Christmas morning. Her family says her death was caused by domestic violence. WRTV's Todd Simmons shows us how they pay tribute to her memory. It is a hard pill to swallow. A very hard pill to swallow. Shania Shaw, a 24-year-old mother of two, was murdered on Christmas Day. Her mother and brother are trying to face the reality. Trust me. But they can't hide the pain. I know, I know. But it's not your fault. It's not your fault. Shania's loved ones let their tears fall like rain on Saturday. These balloons went in the other direction. More than 100 mourners let the family know how much Shania is missed, including it with a different type of rubber. I'm really kind of just speechless. You feel me? I'm really trying to steal. This don't seem real, bro. I, I, excuse my language, but this, this. The family believes Shaw's death is domestic violence. The man arrested for her murder is the father of her children, who are two and one years old. Shaw's mother, Chantel, hopes domestic violence victims see her daughter's murder as a wake-up call. Don't second guess it. Don't think, don't hope, don't wish. If it happened once, it's going to happen again. The family will keep proclaiming Shania's name if it means saving someone else's life. A couple stages after this, it'll start feeling real. But uh, I'm glad I was here to to speak for her. They all spoke for her. We love you, Shania! Because a light as bright as Shania Shaw lingers in the mind long after it's turned off. Your memory is what get left behind, not your presence. And that's what hurts. In Indianapolis, Taj Simmons, WRTV. Taj, thank you. Shaw's family is currently organizing a GoFundMe to help support her two young children.